day 58. Man, oh man, I went out for my 50, what was supposed to be 50 minute run today. And I went too far, which resulted in me doing 13 extra minutes, which is a long time, minute per minute, feels like hour per hour. Um, I ended up doing five and a half miles, something I was not prepared to do, and I, I did not like it. I do not want to do it again. <laughs> um, as I've mentioned, we do, um, we add five minutes to each week. So this week I'm at 50, next week I'll be at 55, and then the next week I'll be at 60. Um, so I'm not supposed to be doing that yet, you know. I should get credit for that somewhere down the line and get a free day or something. But so what happened is I started running and I thought, well, may I have all this time, where can I run to? Um, so I can keep my mind off of, you know, being, uh, keeping my mind off of running, basically. And I thought, well, Elizabeth had just texted and said she was going to be on the treadmill up at the gym. So I thought, well, I'd just run up there and check on her and see if she is. So I ran up there, past the window, looked in, there she was. Then I had to run home. Well, we I used to run up to the gym all the time for my house, but we've moved since then. And I guess it's a little bit different, maybe a mile each way different. So I wasn't prepared for it to take as long as it did. And I guess it got dark, like pitch black dark right at the gym. So on the way home, it, I was running in the dark. I don't really like that very much. It was, um, not only was it dark, but it was also... I had little icy spots and it was wet and I couldn't see where I was running and my dad sees this video he's gonna be like you you better be careful don't do that don't <laughs> so I'll probably get in trouble if he watches this sorry dad um, but so I just kept thinking okay I'm looking at my clock and I'm thinking I have you know eight minutes left or you know, however many minutes and <laughs> I still have a very long way to go and I'm trying to think how can I get home faster and the only answer is to run faster. There's no shortcuts. There's no other ways. I mean, I still have to go. I still have to get there. So I ended up running 63 minutes and five and a half miles. <laughs> so I really just wanted to get to four miles. So tomorrow when I do my run, that's what I'll be doing. Um, anyway, it's, it's good to know I can do it. And so when I do hit that mile mark, I mean that uh, 60 minute mark, I know I can already do it. I guess that'll be all right. Um, and I also worked out with Quentin this morning, and uh, Quentin and Janelle, and uh, I felt so bad for her because at the very end, talk about pressure, we did all this upper body stuff, which was just ridiculous all by itself anyway, and, um, you know, he likes to throw in a lot of core stuff because, you know, I don't have a core right now, but I can tell it's getting stronger, but we do a lot of stuff with that to help, to help build it. Um, but so we did all this upper body stuff and just totally killed our killed it. Then at the end he's like, okay, Janelle, do 15 perfect push-ups on your toes, or both of y'all have to run half a mile. And I was like, oh man, Janelle, come on, don't don't make us run half a mile. You got to get these in. And uh, she took a second, she regrouped, she did it. She busted them out. 15 beautiful push-ups on her toes. So we didn't have to run half a half a mile after all of that. So thank you, Janelle. Um, it was a hard workout. So two really hard, intense workouts today. I'm exhausted. Um, I guess that's about it. That's that's all I can think about right now is is <laughs> those two things. So anyway, hope you guys got your workout in. Hope you're logging your food and off of all the Christmas stuff. I know some of y'all are probably going to be planning for your um, New Year's Eve cheats. So if you are, make sure your diet between then and now is perfect. Proteins, fruits, and vegetables only. And um, that way you can have your cocktail or whatever it is you're going to have without feeling too, too bad about it. Plan for your cheats. So anyway, you guys have a great night. I'll talk to you tomorrow.